details are emerging in this case that are leading investigators to believe that they need to ask questions about whether or not this was an accident. Michigan State Police initially believed that 41-year-old Daniel Armitage pulled his white SUV over to the westbound shoulder of I-696 to change a flat tire. But now it appears that tire was in good condition. The tire was not completely deflated. Um, it did have some air in it, but we don't know if that was truly the reason why he pulled off to the side of the road. We don't know if there were other mechanical issues. The Bloomfield Township man was in the right lane of oncoming traffic early Thursday when he was killed after being hit by several vehicles. One car slammed into the median to avoid the crash. Sergeant John Shields believes the medical examiner's port will answer key questions in their investigation. Based on you know, injury based on whether or not there was any uh, toxicology reports that come back with anything, whether or not there was something else of a medical issue that may have caused him to be in the position he was in when he was subsequently hit. At the time of his death, the Ann Arbor firefighter had been on medical leave for two days because his wife was in the hospital in ICU. Sergeant Shield says Armitage had been involved in a domestic violence dispute with his wife. There are some allegations of domestic assault of some type I don't know to what extent nor who the aggressor was at this point. Bloomfield Township Police confirmed that they are investigating a possible domestic assault on the same street where Daniel Armitage lived. Police say all the information adds to the background of their case in trying to determine the circumstances surrounding Daniel Armitage's death. And the medical examiner's office telling us today that the cause of death in this case still pending. Live in Farmington Hills, 7 Action News. Joanne, back to you.